Custom member information is used to define up to 300 custom fields that allow you to add additional custom information for and about your members. The fields can be used in the member file, in our Clubhouse online web services, and email marketing platform. These fields can also be reported on in the Club Report Generator by using codes M01 to MU0. To create a custom field, navigate to Club Management, Club Setup, Custom Member Information. First, we'll go ahead and start by selecting our club. Custom fields are created using the table seen here, which can be broken down into the following columns. The column number indicates the code for this field. The description is used to describe the field. And the type is used to define what sort of data can be entered into this field. Some of your options include A alphanumeric, N for numeric, D for date, T for table, and Y for a yes or no question. Then you have size, and size is used to define the maximum number of characters for this field entry. If the type is D, date, you must enter one of the following values. If the type is N, numeric, and you wish to store negative values in this field, enter a negative sign in front of the field size. Lastly is additional information. This is used to control the type of entry in this field. Some examples include, if you have a yes or no field, you can go ahead and enter the default value, if any. There is also what we call masking, which offers suggestions when the field is most over. To utilize this option, you're going to use text equals suggestion text. So, for an example, we'll put wine. You can also make a field required by typing in REQD. Just note that you must have the field Mandatory Custom Fields selected in Basic Club Profile for this to work. Lastly, you can use this following code, where 01 is the club code, to include a lookup button for this field, which will pull up the F2 member lookup list. Note that deleting or inserting rows after data has been entered into the member file can result in unexpected consequences due to the change in resulting positions of the fields in the club report generator. Therefore, it is recommended to add additional fields starting with the lowest available column number. As a helpful note, if your club allows members to select any two months where they are not required to meet their minimums, then you can indicate which months to skip by setting up a custom field called Wave Months. So in our description, we're going to put Wave Months. For a type, we're going to use A. And for the size, you're going to use 2 for 1 month or 5 for 2 months. For each member, fill out this new field in their custom info screen within their member profile and indicate their choices of month. So for example, 02,07 for February and July. Remember to use a comma to separate the values with no space in between. The minimum fee billing program will skip the indicated members for those months. You also have the ability to utilize the pick list option. To create a pick list, Place your cursor in the Additional Information field and click Pick List. This setting allows you to define a much more user-friendly table of responses to control what users can choose from to have entered into the fields when in use in the member file. It is recommended that Pick List be used over the older T-table list of valid responses. You can have different Pick Lists for each line of custom member info questions. In this setting, you can add pick fields and specify a value as well as a description. A lookup button will appear beside these fields, which will pull up the pickup list for this field. Note that pick lists will only work for alpha and numeric type fields. Just make sure you go ahead and click OK if you've made any changes. Now that you have created custom member information fields, you can add member data by navigating to Club Management, Member File, and set up Edit Members. Go ahead and select your club, as well as your member. The custom member information can be found in the custom info on the right-hand navigation. 
Custom Member Information fields will automatically appear in this window, where you can now input the member data. If you use the Pickup List, for example here, we will have the Lookup tool, which will allow us to choose from one of those pre-assigned answers. And if you utilize the Member Lookup List, this will pull up the membership list for you.